Everybody and welcome back to my channel. I had to come in y'all and show y'all this Bluetooth music. I told you what to chase. Told you how to run the race. Every move is on the page, but I didn't like their way. I had to fight and misbehave. I had to find a way to change. I hate I wrapped my dang on box. I turned it sideways by mistake, y'all. But this hookah is everything. It's a three holes hookah. You really can't see the back of it right now because I have a bear in front of it. But I also put this gift set that we got from um, Burlington. Uh, who was it? I think it was 550. 550, I think, y'all. Listen to that hookah. I gotta sell this for two hundred and fifty dollars, y'all. I got to. Okay, then this one right here, I took the rainbow perfume. Hold on, let me cut this down. It's the Bluetooth hookah for me, honey. Okay, so um, this one right here, y'all see, I wrap my boxes. I did them color coordinate except this one. Um, this one I went with this paper that came from Walmart, which is like satin, shiny, glossy look to me. So I did that with the, um, what is this? The Paris Lamar, I want to say. Amor? Amor? Um, I put a flavor tip, some cold, some shisha, rainbow perfume, rainbow perfume, rainbow perfume, rainbow perfume, okay? Um, besides this big old, I did put a Burlington set in the back of this one. I put the City Train set in the back of this one. Another Burlington set. This was two fifty, and this was three ninety nine. They all have a Burlington set in there, so I'm selling these for two hundred dollars. Two hundred dollars. Besides the Burlington set, I have a fan, a um, what is that? Bath salt, Dove bar soap, Dove deodorant, a bunnet. A brush, and I told y'all with my buttons, I have to have a little brush because I'm it's just me, my opinion, y'all. So I always put it like that as a set. Um, the only thing it looks like it does not have is a body loafer, in which I will put one on the side. Like I have the purple one here, I wish I had another pink one, y'all. I had some pink ones. One of these kids probably don't roll through here and got it from me, but I had I got this one on the side in purple. I wish I had this one in pink, but I'm not going to hold this basket up. I'm just going to put a clear one. I do have a clear one I can stick on the side. Because I feel like that's all it need. It got all them bathing products, but nothing to wash the body with. Um, but that was about it, y'all. I'm selling this basket for 200 It has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven Dollar Tree items and the um, perfume. So that's about $13. And then I have my cold, my shisha, my flavor tip, and the hookah. And the $4 set. So $13, $17, and then the hookah was $17.99. It's a hookah case. So I spent about, just rounded out to $40. Um, and I'm going to sell it for $200. That's $160 profit, y'all. But that's my price. The retail value on this, what they would sell it for in the store, is probably about $100 or something by itself. Okay, I buy this from a wholesale store. A regular person just can't walk in there and buy. You have to have a sales tax certificate to purchase from them. So, of course, it's not like, well, you pay $17.99. Yeah, but this is where the hookah stores get their hookah from. So, more than likely, they sell that for about $100. $100 and some dollars, y'all. Um, that other music that don't came in by mistake. Let me see. Oh, it was only on for 27 seconds. Hopefully that don't hurt me. Um, then I have this one right here. So, like I said, $40, a little bit under $40. Boom, $200. This one I'm using some bath salt, some clay mask, another $2.50 um, set, which also I already have some bath salt, a loafer, um, a spa headband, a hair turban bath salt and i already have that stuff already in it and then i love this one right here y'all this one is very cute to me this body wash i'm in love with it i put a flower down there some dove um a brush and i have my bunnet over here 
my Dove deodorant, the rainbow set, a shisha, I mean a flavored tip, shisha, cold, and a bear. Um, I took little pieces like this to put on my shisha bags. I used those bags from Dollar Tree. Um, over to this one. Oh, let me tell you how much I paid. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six, seven with the bare Dollar Tree items. Rounded out to eight. That's ten dollars plus this thirteen. That was two fifty. Rounded out to sixteen um, plus this. So round about the same thing. Under forty dollars. Still one sixty. I would make a profit if I sold it for two hundred. Um, I have been sending them the hookahs. I'm like one twenty five for the hookahs or one twenty five for the um, pink bags. They have not been ordering like they normally do. So hopefully next week. They'll get it going, but look at that. That is so cute. This one I want $250 for. I honestly know if I was in a different area with different people, I can sell it for way more. Definitely about $350, but $250 for my area, the low, you know. I don't know, just $250, because y'all remember I had the other $250 went over that I really couldn't get off. This is definitely, it's, it's way more than that other one that I wanted $250 for. Like it's Bluetooth. The other one isn't Bluetooth. This is three holes. The other one is two holes. And I wanted $250 for it. Couldn't get it. So I still got it. I had it for Valentine's Day. Like my husband said. He was like $250, honey. If they ain't got $250, we'll keep it the next year. He said I'll give it a day day or something, honey. But $250 definitely no, not going down at all. Um, Hopefully somebody gets it. If not, like he said, it'll be a gift for day day, honey. Um, that's my daughter who be helping me sell all the baskets because she loved this. She loved this Bluetooth. She was up here playing it and showing it off herself. But anyway, this hookah itself was $50. It was $50. So they probably would retail it at about $200 by itself. So that's why I say this is actually a $350 basket. But the people I'm dealing with, the area I'm dealing with, um, we're going to price it at $250. Like I said, the other basket at $250. It didn't, have, it didn't have no Bluetooth hook in there, so I really should be way more than this. Really should. I would have to catch the right person for this one. Because this one should be about $300, especially if I'm doing that other one over there for $250. But since I brought it down from Valentine's Day, I tried at $200. This one I have the Rachel, what is this? The Paris Hilton Rogue Set. Um, um, a pet Pantene shampoo and conditioner, the Pantene from um, Dollar Tree, a pink bag, a flavored tip, some Dove, a bear, a rainbow set. Um, back here, I have a loafer. What else is that in there? A loafer, um, a face mask, and this is something else got to do with it. But y'all, I got this gold. Um, shreds from the hamper house very cute definitely brought out the basket very nice y'all um, I need to tape that up there sit this up a little bit more but that's about all I put in this basket as well um, the main valuable thing is this three holes flavor I mean this three holes Bluetooth hookah that's my price of this basket I really feel like it should be at least be 300 but hey it depends so we'll see how it go Corn, come on, I'm doing a video and I'm, I'm, come on. He's a gamer, so he's back there laughing and playing and talking to his little people, but he's interrupting our video. All right, y'all, I'm about to get ready to wrap these up. That's it for this video. I did want to just jump in and show y'all these beautiful hookahs. Um, I didn't do a, a, a video setting them up. So, listen, she's going to do her video. You want me to do my video? So, listen, you I want you to do your video. Yeah, we'll do your video later. So if you feel like sticking around, y'all. One more. Valentine's Day, I did these. Um, not the same hookahs. I didn't do this one. I did like a uh, wait, Leah. I did the orange. I did a purple. I did a few hookahs Valentine's Day, and I was never able to post that video. So if you all want to just stick around and watch the rest of it, I'm gonna throw it in here. Cause why not? I made a whole video and never did, did even post it. So, um, it was some good information in that video. Leah, go sit down, baby. It was some good information in that video. I'll go ahead and put it in, y'all. But other than that, see y'all in the next video. Hope y'all enjoyed these hookahs. The first look at them, I know y'all are like, oh, I wish I could get some. But unfortunately, they've been selling out a little bit on the hookahs, and I stopped going for people. I stopped going for people. Because it was a little challenge to be committed to 
driving over there, getting it, and then shipping it to people. And then I might go one day and then somebody else the next day. And it was like almost a job. So unfortunately, I do not offer me going to the warehouse for you at all. You actually have to be located in Georgia. They don't have a website. Go in there, Leah. They don't have a website that you can go online and order from. So unless you actually drive up here to Georgia, you would kind of not be able to get any. Hopefully, they fix their stock up. Let me turn the Bluetooth off, Leah. Hopefully, they uh, get their stock back right. Here. Go in there. And then you all can drive up and get y'all some. But right now, they're kind of long stop. So it wouldn't benefit you probably to drive up here if you're not in Georgia. But like I said, some good information in the video. I'm going to go ahead and throw that clip in. Because I did record it for y'all. Talked a lot in the video. Um, other than that, see y'all later. Hope y'all like them. Hope y'all get this video a thumbs up. I can't look at that, y'all. <coughs> oh, excuse me. All right, bye, y'all. Hey, y'all. I had to make this video to show y'all how the wholesale supplier is not playing with their hookahs. This is actually a hookah case that you get to break it down and keep it in and transport, y'all. This is my first time getting one of these, and I am in love with it. This is the one that I got. It is so cute. It's real nice. I feel like I just want to buy them and resell them at this point because y'all is going to, y'all not, not going to know how to act with these. This is so nice, y'all. I'm about to get ready to put these in a basket and see what they do. I got another one back there. I actually got another one down here on the floor. This one I spent a little change, a pretty change for it. This is one with a, um, whoa, thank you, baby. Good save. This is a three holes hookah with a Bluetooth play music on it. So, I'm going to get these basket up. I'm going to use the boxes, and I'll show y'all how they come out. So, I pulled this one out so I can show y'all. Um, it has I love you on the side of it. Definitely good for Valentine's Day or Mother's Day. Um... And it's Bluetooth. So, I got it charging, but I just wanted to show y'all. Just put it on. Welcome to Music Hookah. Bluetooth note. Too freaking cute. So, wait till I put this baby in a basket. This is $250 basket. Mmm. So, I have already um, wrapped my boxes. I have um, one, two, three, four, five, six, two, four, six. Yep, that's right. Plus the um, gold one. I have seven hookahs that I'm gonna wrap. I've already picked out the color I'm gonna use for my boxes. All of that stuff. Each box matched the hookah color. Um, I got some more boxes over here. I wrapped this one big. And I just freaking realized Y'all, I just realized that I got the front of my box wrapped the wrong way. It's supposed to be wrapped the other direction. Oh my goodness. So, this is definitely not my front. That's how my front supposed to look. But I done messed up and wrapped it wrong. And I just realized that. Lord, how the world I do that? Anyway, y'all. Y'all make mistakes. I put some horns on the top of it. They won't even see that line no more. Anyhow, I have already wrapped my hook, my boxes. I've already stuffed my boxes. I used this packaging tape, which was $12.99 at U-Haul Storage, a big old package. And I have wrapped a lot of stuff with it, y'all. I just ran out this morning. So, after I ran out, I had some um, peanuts here. They sell this bag for $6. It was a big bag of peanuts for $6 at Hamper House. The Hamper House in Forest Park, they have that. That's also where I got my shreds from. Um, so I've been using that. What I did was I pulled some down. Well, I didn't need it in these. I just put some other stuff in those. One of these I did. Um, but I pulled some of it down, the peanuts, and then I still put this on top of it so it can be hit, not shifting and moving around. Other than that, I have these, which after the summer, they have these on sale. I got this from one of my subscribers. It do take a lot to fill up these boxes. I think two of these will fill up a boxes, but when you're getting them, 
90% off. They definitely help you cut these down and then you can put them inside of the boxes to fill it up. So I have those as well besides my packaging paper and my peanuts. I didn't get any newspaper, but I have had a subscriber say you can go to a newspaper place and all of the paper that's maybe going to be recycled, they may um, option off to give it to you. You just have to go there and ask because I got two people in here that did say they got some paper. But anyhow, that was a long intro telling you all what I was doing. I'm going to now that I've already wrapped them, packaged them, I'm going to put a tissue paper on the top, some shredded paper on the top, and then I'm about to start building these baskets, y'all. Let's get to this video. This is the one. I am so in love with this hookah. And it has I love you on it. This is definitely good for Valentine, Mother's Day. Um, honestly, I don't know if men really smoke hookahs. I'm sure they do. But um, I don't know. I just do them for women. Okay, so anywho, let's get to the video, y'all. So I know y'all waiting on that gold. And that's the one I can't wait to make. But for now, I love this one as well. This is the one I'm going to do first. It is a pretty peachy color. Also can be, um, it's orangey, but I say peachy. It came with a hookah case. I paid $16.99 for this. And I know some of these hookah stores, y'all, I feel like they're like, why is she telling everybody where we get this stuff from? If everybody knows where to get it, they're not going to want to come to us to buy it, you know? So, um, I do hate that I'm, I'm messing it up for the hookah stores, but I do want my su subscribers to know what they can get stuff to put in these baskets, okay? Um, I did see that one of my subscribers, and she's one of my good subscribers, I've follow her on instagram and all of that stuff and she showed me her basket which she took hers out the as you seen i was selling all of mine with it inside the plastic because i didn't want to touch that stuff so um she was selling hers with it already put into the hookah and i just felt like it looked so much better y'all and that's what i'm gonna do here i am gonna put a little piece of tape around it so it can stand up straight and then I'm going to pull out this box. But I do think it looks so much cuter when it is out like this. There we go. Should have did a longer piece all the way around anyway. I don't know what I'm thinking, y'all. Hold on. I already got that piece taped together. I hope this gonna look cute because normally I just lay it inside the package um, and I don't tape it together I just lay the whole thing inside the package inside of the clear package that it came in y'all know how I do it if y'all seen my other video hopefully y'all have I've been getting a lot of people that's watching the, the videos saying everything is helpful and I really do appreciate that it definitely helps me with YouTube I'm hoping that I am inspiring some people, which a lot of people say I am. And I really do appreciate that because I try my best to get on here and help as much as I can. Um, I am a real person, so I don't sugarcoat, man. I don't got a, a YouTube voice, so one of my subscribers say. I just have my real voice, even though sometimes I don't like my real voice. But I'm just a regular person, just like y'all out here trying to make it. So any likes and comments on a video definitely helps the um, YouTube algorithm with putting me out. That is much cuter. Oh my gosh. I could have did something better with this one. But that is much cuter. Too cute. Okay. Um, the little hookah thing that comes with it. The Y'all know what it is. I'm going to put a heart on it. I keep a bag right beside me on my table. It actually hangs on my um, my neck that holds the camera so I can throw trash away as I go. You don't want a house full of trash when you get done. And I'm just going to put a heart on it. I love them Dollar Tree hearts. I kind of put them on everything. And then I could take that down so it won't be moving around. But let's get to building this basket, y'all. That's what we finna do. We is finna get to building this basket. Let me put another one on the other side. 
I hope everybody has been um, doing well with their sales. I know I had a live last night, y'all. And it did end rudely, interruptly. My phone went dead. I'm sorry I had been out all day. But, hey, I appreciate everybody that was in the live. You might have seen a little bit too much that I kind of don't want y'all to see. I know everybody said they love how real I am. But some stuff is not meant for YouTube, okay? So I do apologize. I was out there hustling last night, talking to everybody and anybody that walked up, okay? Um, This box, I had it. I got this same color wrapping paper, which I got from, I believe, Dollar Tree. And it's hard to find those wrapping papers. Y'all had to move some stuff around to get these wrapping papers. Yeah, I am. I'm getting ready to finish these baskets up. And yes, I will be outside. I do have a tent. Yep, that's my dad wondering if I'm going outside today. Anything. I, I know I would like some cheese and eggs this morning. Cheese and eggs. Yeah. I'm sorry, y'all. I had to put my order in. My father is here, and um, he want to cook breakfast today, Saturday. He don't work on the weekend. And, yes, my dad stays with me. I actually built a bedroom downstairs in my house so he can be right here with me. Okay? All right, y'all. Let me see. I'm going to use white for this. When I ran out of my box that I got from Uline, like I said, that box was 41 when I got it. I don't think I paid the shipping any attention because I had so much other stuff with it. But when I just tried to order that big box, 10 pound box of wrapping paper shred, I mean shredding paper from Uline, it came up to $73. And which, like I said, it's made it through every holiday with me and even through my strawberry and other sales. So it is a good amount, but I was like $73. So I just went and bought a big bag of, this was $6. Um, and I got it from the Hamper House. That is, um, once again in Forest Park. Forest Park, Georgia. And that's why I got my shreds. They also have baskets. If you all end up going in there and getting something from them, those of you that's in Georgia or even rolled up here in Georgia and grabbed something, make sure y'all say Yummy Tea Kate sent y'all, okay? Because I was having to talk with the owner. He was like, I've been getting real busy in the last few days. You know, normally my wife say, I just sit here and do nothing, and I laughed with them and everything, but I was like, I wonder if those are some of my subscribers coming in here and buying stuff, because y'all been doing Amazon out. Y'all been buying Amazon out, so I really appreciate the links that y'all click and all of that stuff. That helps me as well, y'all. Bag of stuff I don't went and bought, and while I'm looking at it, I didn't even notice that was in there. I can use these. These are match that basket. All right, so we have our big box here. We're going to use our case as our backer. Okay? And the reason I'm going to turn it this way where they can see the handle so they know that it is a case right here. Boom. I'm going to put me the hookah over here. Uh-oh. Really don't want to be touching a thing that much. Put this in the front. Y'all, that is so pretty. Come on now, gooseneck. Okay, there we go. Y'all can see it a little bit better. This is so pretty. Okay. Boom. Let me move this out of the way for now. Let's see what else we're going to put in this thing right here. The other ones I already kind of have put together. I already got my color scheme matched up uh, oh i did on this one too i have some bath salt i wish i had another urn sponge that would have been right went right with it but today i'm like let's just get it over with i'm tired of running around going and get stuff i'm over it i'm gonna put some dove in it i wish i had a little bell to put with it but i don't um this box of dove would actually go good with it because it's that kind of that, kind of that color. I'm going to need some more shreds to hold that up. But yeah, y'all, these hookah baskets are definitely something else. Are definitely a vibe to get and try to get. Now, I have been getting DMs all the last few days since I posted these. And I would like to let y'all know that um, 
One second, y'all. I would like to let y'all know that you do have to have a sales tax certificate. They gonna make me run to the door, ain't they? One second, y'all. I'm sorry. Sorry about that. Um, what I was saying? Yeah, you have to have a sales tax certificate and they're not online. So, hopefully that answered the question for everybody asking for the information on the hookahs. Um, because this is so heavy and it keep want to fall, I'll put this in front of the drizzle popcorn. Mm. That's how we're going to do that. And building your basket is really nothing. As long as you got your stuff that's going to coordinate it, you know what you put in it. I just said that word right. Every time I say that word right, I need a hero cookie. But anyway, anytime you put your stuff in there and you've color coordinated it, it's really nothing to build. You just build from there. Build on up. Um, I did have some BB stuff. One second. These are some stuff that I have that matches this box. Okay? Um, I have this that came from Dollar Tree. That's good to go in any box. I got to go back and find some more, y'all. I ain't even seen them online. If I see them online, I want to buy a hundred of them. Um, I haven't took this sticker off. I got to stop doing that. As y'all know, that's a good way to get y'all sticker off of these boxes with a heat gun or a blow dryer. Thanks again, S. Marie and Versatile, for that. I feel like this video is going kind of slow. It is early, y'all. That's probably what it is. But this is a BB set that we did get from Bel um from Burlington Coat Factory. I think I paid $149. It's labeled at $7.99, but I think I paid about $1.49. It's a four-piece set, and it's really cute. And I felt like it kind of matched. Even though it's not green, orange, I feel like it matches it. Good enough for me, okay? It also, I have the bigger one, which is a two, four, six-piece set. It has body mist and hand cream. Three hand cream, three body mist. I think this one is a good one, too. I'm feeling like um, this box needs to be about $200. I have been having a problem with the people that I've been advertising and trying to sell to. They haven't been wanting to get, um, well, I sold my hookahs for $150. So, but, but I do, it's like one out of so many would get the $150 one. Most of them really just want something cheap. So I want to sell this for $200, but I don't want to be left with it. But at the end of the day, it is what it is. Sorry about that, y'all. These dang on nails. And I don't like them. One second. Huh. Man, man, can you pull this off for me? Glad you was walking by. It's going to be a little hot, but take your finger and get that. No, get the rest of it. Hurry up, it's hot. Okay, let me redo it. Let me redo it. One second, y'all. Oh, shoot. I don't burnt the box. Y'all be mindful of these boxes and the plastic when you are doing it. I did have a subscriber already tell me that. Be mindful of that. It burnt your hand? All right, thank you, son. What I'm going to do is put a little hard over that. No foul, no harm. But yeah, with building these boxes, um, as you know, if you've seen any of my other videos, I like to build them, color coordinate them. That's, that little peachy, it kind of is peachy to me. So boom, there it goes. A BB set behind it, but you really can't see the set. Maybe I should put the smaller one here first. And then the bigger one, because I want $200 for this. This is a good $200 box. I'm not going to put any Valentine Day candy in him because I'm not sure if it's going to sell or not. Um, and this is somebody trying to buy a hookah basket. One second, child. Hello? Hey, guys. Yeah, I got hookah baskets. Yeah, you know which, which one you want. 
You want the 150 win or the um, 125? What you need? Okay. Sorry about that, y'all. That's somebody that is on the way to pick up, pick up a hookah baskets. Even last year, I sold all my hookah baskets. So, why I didn't worry about all the hookah baskets first, I don't know. But I did want to make sure I had got uh, content out for everybody that had access to certain kind of stuff. You know, um, it is some orange looking stuff like this that I could have went to Dollar Tree and got. Even, um... They have little things like this. I'm sure they had something that could have matched this more. I just don't, I just didn't have the time, y'all. My phone is blowing up. I am so sorry, but guess what? We're going to do this video. There ain't nothing going to stop me for getting this information out to y'all. Um, But that's how I build my basket. If you can see, I had people DM me in their basket stuff with sitting in their basket. I kind of don't like that sitting in look. I like my stuff to sit up on top of it. It look a little bit better to me, but y'all baskets are still looking great out there. Good job on the baskets. But anyway that's what i'm going with it i feel like i need something here which i could just put some candy there and be done with it i really could y'all don't see how i be putting it together y'all see that okay my camera messing up on me that's it that is all i am going to give them this hookah right here with the case i paid 16.99 at 17 dollars okay I don't pay any taxes or anything because, like I said, you had to be sales tax exempt to shop from them. Um, so, we have $17 for the hookah. I have one. I pay $2.19 for this. So, I'm not going to count that as a Dollar Tree item. I have one, two, three, four, five Dollar Tree items at $125. That's $6.25. Just say $8 with tax. All right. And then I have this that I paid $2 for. Um, the box I did get for free and this stuff. I know I paid about $149, $199 for these boxes. So all together, I feel like, um, I really, even though I haven't paid this much, you always supposed to double or triple your amount. So I really want to do this one for, I put under $30 in this basket, really under $25. And that would include the shrink wrap, everything that I put in it. But I feel like that's all this basket need with this hookah. It really don't even need these two sets, y'all. It really doesn't. It can go with one of them. And be done. I feel like I want them both or even just this one. BB hookah, hookah set. I don't know. By the time y'all see this, it's going to be wrapped up and ready to be sold. If I sell it this way, either way it is. I want $175 for this basket. I won't, do, I won't go lower than $150. I really want $200. But like I said, I only put $30 in this basket. So that's why I said $175. I will, my profit would be that $25 and then $5 out my... I would basically make um, $145 off this package. Which is definitely tripling and quadrupling the retail value of it. But it is what it is. In the store, these would probably cost like once somebody sells. I'm not sure I don't really buy hookahs. So I definitely don't know. But I know that I want to sell this for $175 at least. I don't know if I should put this up there with it though, y'all. I really don't. What y'all think? Mm. If I put that up there, it's going to go for $200. Even though I only add a $1.49 value, this is a big old box. I do feel like though... In order for me, I wouldn't be able to wrap it with shrink wrap. I would have to wrap it with tool. And that's what um, is going to make me probably not put this up there. You'll see. I'll let y'all know at the end of this video. But I'm going to go ahead and end that there. That's everything. Again, all I really used, my main item was this hookah. And then I got the few one, two, three, four, five, six. Plus the candy and then seven and eight items. As you notice in all of my stuff, I don't put no more than ten items. Eight to ten items, that's all they will get. But that's all. Eight to ten items. That's all it took. And this looks like a $200 basket. Probably more than that. Y'all let me know. I feel like I want to take this off. Because it is taken away from this cuteness right here. So I'm going to leave that as it is. And let it be. And that's going to be it y'all. I'm not going to include a Valentine's Day candy. Because like I said today is actually Saturday. Valentine's is Tuesday. 
and I don't want to include a candy and then I have to unbag it and, and resell it just in case nobody wants to pay me my price. If y'all seen my live last night, I had a guy, I had a basketball 125. He wanted to offer me $90, which was a little disrespectful. I was like, okay, give me 95. I know for a fact I didn't put more than $15 in the basket, so that's why I said 95. That mean that, that I will at least make an $80 profit. But gladly he didn't go for it. I end up still taking his $80 and having him spend that whole $80 on the value of another basket not discounted at all so that worked out good i will bargain with some people i know my lord's in i know what i will take and what i won't take i i'm not desperate i just won't say well give me what you got no i won't i will work it out with you and i walked him to a basket that i felt like really wasn't worth what i got it for anyway so you can get that one it ain't got nothing but 15 dollars worth of stuff in it anyway that may i, I mean 80 dollars profit after you get through buying your stuff so, yeah, I, I was bar bargaining with him, but for this, I would not go lower than 175 One, I mean, 150 145 at the least. When I say my lowest would be 150 they got to come close to that 150 I'm already at 175 You can't come close to 150 That's between 145 and 150 You cannot get it. It will sit here until Mother's Day. All right, so that's how we're going to do with those bargain shoppers and those the ones that want to take you down on your price. Walk them over there and give them something else. It still worked out. I didn't lose a sale. I still made that same amount of money he was trying to give me for something that I wanted more for. But that's it, y'all. That is all for that big basket right there. That is all they're going to get. And hopefully I sell it for 175 I'll let y'all know in one of these other videos. Once I wrap it up with a bow, I think I got an orange bow to go with it. It's going to sell like uh, crazy. Okay, let's go to the next video, y'all. I mean the next hookah. All right, so I am on to the next one. This one I'm doing that it's going to be blue. I have my blue box already. And I'm about to live. Say hey to YouTube, Liv. Say hey, Liv. Look at the, the camera right there. Say hey. 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 Sweet baby. But anyway, I wanted to say hey to that YouTube. Um, Liv tell y'all hey for those of y'all that was saying I want to see Leah. But Leah run around the house how she wants to, honey. Leah ain't got beef. Mama. Hey, by the time she walk around how she wants to. She comfortable. At least she told y'all hey this time. I am on to the next basket. I'm using this one this time. So for those of you that's looking into getting these hookahs and setting it up and um selling them for balance mother's day or whatever you're gonna sell them for next year valentine day mother's day whatever you're selling it for this will just give you some ideas on how i'm putting it together okay i am gonna use i'm using this one because um the rest of them are basically pink i really don't want to it's throwing it off already so it is what it is with that. Oh, let me put some shred in there, y'all. I'm going to use blue shreds. It's going to be so cute. Y'all said, let me get on here and show you two how I'm doing these baskets for these hookahs. Because a lot of people has been in my DM, in my comments trying to find out who the hookah plays who the hookah plays i've said it so many different times in the videos um i'm guessing people hasn't saw the other videos or what but if you were to go back and look at my videos you would definitely hear a lot of stuff a good information that i give out in my videos i've already gave out everybody that i use and i kind of repeat it over and over i don't mind but I said, since everybody's asking, let me go ahead and make a video for them. I got this from Family Dollars. I knew I needed a, a blue bear. This bear was $5. Um, I, I want to put him in the front. Okay. My hookah right now is just standing up by itself. But before I get through and let it stand up by itself, let me go ahead and put the hook, hooks on them like I did the last one. Also, I have this that I got from Dollar Tree. This brush I got from Dollar Tree goes right along with it. I have this that I got from Dollar Tree, which is some exfoliating lip 
Oh, that slip scrub. I need one of those. That's nice. Um, but that's an effoliating lip scrub. I had some blue top dove that'll match it. I also have a blue box of dove that's real cute. I like this color. But honestly, I got a different one. But it matches the bear. But I do have a darker blue as well, which let me match it up with it and see. Dang, that's definitely the blue, but this matches the bear and everything else. I can kind of use either or. I'm going to use this one, though. So I got the Dove. I don't have a blue top perfume. I wish I would have thought about it because I could have gotten one. I have a candle maker that I have from Dollar Tree, a whole candle making set. I'm going to use the one that got the blue colors at the top. Um, if y'all haven't seen those at y'all Dollar Tree, y'all should go check them out. They are too cute. Definitely too cute. Um, what else can I put in here? I see I got some green stuff over here. That'll go with my green camera. I mean, I'm sorry, my my green hookah. My son was over here touching stuff and throw me off. I got this. Everything is going to be matching up so cute in here, y'all. Even though that yellow kind of throws it off, it still matches. It's going to work out. Um, other than that, I have, you know, I got my dove. What else I have? I gotta get a chocolate. I do have a chocolate that got some blue in it. So there, come on, come over there, baby. I'm on camera. Matches it, slam up. And what else can I put in here? But now I don't have too much other stuff that matches in blue. I do have to put my um shisha and coal in it. I gotta find my scissors. I'm gonna curl that real quick. And then I got a flavored tip. I bought the whole thing from them. I think this was like either $15.99. I think it was $15.99. Let me get one of these one second. I'm going to get a blue one to match it. And this is going to be so freaking cute. Now, it does have some hot pink in it right here. I can see if maybe this will match it. It does, but I might say that for the purple hookah. Um, what else can I do? One second, y'all. One second. Sorry about that, y'all. I did have to go handle a couple things with my baby Lil and packing and stuff like that. But anyway, I showed you most of the stuff I'm putting in this hookah. Let's see if I can get it where you can see. Well, you can see enough of it. You can see it. Um, I don't really have much to put in this one, actually. I'm trying to see. I'm going to hold this off until I'm almost done with it. So I put the sponge. I wish I had some of those blue bath salts that um Dollar Tree had. That would have been cute. We're going to put the candle here in the front, towards the front, so they can see it. I'm going to put this towards the back because I'm really not studying it as much. I really don't like that color anyway. The dove I'm going to put inside of his. As you can see, he's going to hold it. Okay. I also want to see if he can hold. Look at that. That is too cute. Okay. Um. Now what am I going to put in here? Sit down, honey. There we go. Um, I can fit the other dove here. And I can fit the bar soap here. Everything in the front. I hope y'all can see that. Let me move this out the way. Um, This is a hookah tip. I'm going to try to just squeeze that right on in there. Um, I did have this. I can just turn that sideways so they can see it from the side. Okay. Um, I have this box of candy. I'm going to actually lay that this way. They can see it from that side. Y'all, we only have a few more days to go. It is crazy that Valentine finally don't came. I'm still up here making baskets. That junk is so crazy. But the reason I am making baskets, like I said, um, and that's why I was trying to stress the fact 